There are really only two features on the new Razer Blade laptop that betray its origins as a gaming machine. The keyboard still lights up, with each key capable of displaying more than a million colors across several funky patterns, and there's a glowing snake logo on the back of the lid. Now if you want to masquerade as a non-gamer, you can turn the keyboard backlight off, and same with the snake logo. Or you can choose to embrace your inner gamer and crank the keyboard lights up to full thermonuclear blast. Take another step and add Razer accessories like the Hyperflux mouse pad, which can be synced together into one glorious light show. But none of that matters if this isn't a great gaming laptop. Fortunately, this new version takes some pretty big leaps past the previous model. Now, we've always really liked the blade for general gaming chops, but the 14-inch display had a thick bezel that felt kind of dated, and the GPU topped out at an NVIDIA GTX 1060. Fine for mainstream gaming, but not exactly top of the line. For the new version of Razer's flagship laptop, the display gets a great upgrade to a 15-inch screen while keeping roughly the same footprint. It's also got a very thin bezel around it, and the model I tested had a full HD 144Hz screen. More importantly, the components inside get updated as well to an Ace Gen Core i7 and up to an NVIDIA 1070 GPU. And to make sure we notice just how well this laptop fits in that NVIDIA 1070 while staying so slim, Razer sent a little attache case along with it. What was inside? A graphics card? Candy? No, it was a copy of the Blade's new vapor chamber cooling system.